You never heard of a vagina called a box before? No. Because you, you put things inside of it. All right, welcome back, everybody. Welcome to the podcast. It's been a little while. Hello. There's been a lot going on. It has been. And uh, so we're finally back here with the community, the awesome community. Look how many people are here. There's so many people. My Look God, it's people. a huge podcast this time. Yeah, Why? What are you people. guys doing? It's Friday night. Go out and, and party. Look at them. They're, they're all partying already. Look at oh, that. Oh, yeah, they're in the party. Exciting. This is a real party. So if you don't know what the podcast is, uh, it's a place on Discord. You come join Discord. You come in, come in here into this podcast chat whenever we say that we're on. And then uh, you'll be able to talk with us, and we'll we'll come up with topics, and we want to hear what you have to say. Yeah, can you believe it? Say. An actual conversation with Gamer Bust themselves. Oh my god! Oh, the, the as if the prestige, <laughs> the prestige. Yes, is that the even the proper to to use you. of that word? Yes. Cool. So, <laughs> yeah. basically, you come in, you pot in, and then the bot will pick you, and we we converse, and everybody gets to talk, uh, not at the same time, just like one at a time. Everybody gets to yeah. Talk. To, to kind of call in. Dude, one day I would love to just set the unmute on the entire VC. We could do it at some point. It's <laughs> going to just be a madhouse. It'd be hilarious. Uh, so come join us. And the topic for today is... Is that the part where you want me to take, take over? Is memorable dreams and or nightmares. Yes, that was the part. We want to... We so want dreams to... or nightmares. Yeah. We all have them. Yeah. Uh, and uh, I've got some interesting ones. Brett obviously has some interesting, interesting ones. Do I? I don't know that I ever said that. Yeah, you said that they were the most interesting dreams you've ever had, and you couldn't <laughs> wait to tell me on the podcast. I mean, I've I've got a few stories, but it's we'll get to stories. it when we get to it. Can, yeah, can can dreams and nightmares be called stories? Well, it's I mean, mo- the stuff that happens around it, maybe. Yeah, that's like the you're thing. Sleepwalking, exactly. You a spatula, uh, uh, and there's I'll a woman explain. bent over. Okay, well, I guess we're we're starting uh, already, okay. right? Yeah, yeah. Because here's here's the thing. I guess I'll start. Um, <laughs> uh, Light it up. I I have really bad insomnia, so I don't really sleep like a normal person. So every day is a nightmare. Every day is a nightmare, yes. It's a waking nightmare. Uh, in order to actually sleep, to get functional rest, uh, I have to take sedatives. Mm-hmm. So those sedatives usually don't allow for actual dreams. Mm-hmm. Um, and when they do, they're very bizarre. But what I will say is um, when I first got on those sedatives, I... I uh, pissed my bed as a 23-year-old man because, <laughs> because I I was peeing in a dream <laughs> and and That's I was not very long ago. I was yeah, I mean, well I got the insomnia you, pretty recently. You know they say serial killers wet the bed. Oh shit. Yeah. Yeah, they also fucking run YouTube channels <laughs> and, <laughs> and are named Brett. Uh-huh. No, I would never kill anybody. At least not anybody over 18. <laughs> Go on. Whoa, that was dark. Go on. Um, other than that, I think... What was your first dream? My first dream? First dream ever that you remember. Uh, I remember I had a... There was a, a book that I really liked as a kid called Froggy Learns to Swim. Uh-huh. And it was a book that teaches you how to swim. And there was a little frog and it was super cute. And he had sunglasses. And uh, I had a dream that I was just chilling with Froggy. And we were, we were swimming together. <laughs> <laughs> it was fantastic. I have a lot of water related. So I have a lot of water, water dreams. <laughs> that's all that you have is just water dreams. Yeah, well, but I'm also deathly afraid of the ocean. All right, do you have do you have that problem that that's common in a lot of dreams mm-hmm. like like uh ones where you can't run or you have problems standing? I I or had like, those a lot as a kid. You know, those I, common ones everyone has. Yeah, I don't think I've had any recently, not within like 5 or 6 years. No. No. But like I said, I don't have normal <clears throat> sleep because I'm on fucking, like, elephant tranquilizers and shit. Nice. Yeah. It's pretty dope. So, uh, for me, yeah, first dream I remember, uh, I was a kid. Okay. And uh, there's, there's this whole thing that happened around it. I had a little toy box next to me. Okay. Um, and so, uh, I had a dream, and the dream was about a walrus. And oh. the wal- I was inside of a well, and there was a ladder in the middle. It was a big well. Huh. There's enough space for a walrus in me, and we I was running from it. Holy shit! You found it. Ah! You broke Sorry, it. go on. 
For those no of you not watching, way, dude, I haven't seen that in over twenty years. For those of you not watching, there is an image posted just oh now, so you God, might want to see it. Sorry, understand why Brett just like screamed. Sorry, that was <laughs> massive fucking nostalgia for a second there. Uh, so inside of this well, yeah, uh, it's large enough for you to run around. There's uh, there's just me and this walrus, and this walrus was chasing me. I have no I have no idea why. And every time I try to climb the ladder, mm-hmm. uh, he would get too close, and I'd jump off because it. I, hmm. I thought it could climb the ladder after me. So I guess you could um, call him a walrus. <laughs> and I fell in my toy box <laughs> after that dream. Oh, Somehow. damn, really? Yeah, my bed was going one way, and it was perpendicular to me, so I don't know uh, how that worked. Mm. I, like, t- turned sideways to fall into it. Was it, like, a toy chest, or was it, like... No, it was, like, one of those plastic ones. Oh. Ugh. Fisher Price, got the red top, white white around the sides. Did you cry? Uh no I was I was tripping out when I woke up though oh. inside of a toy box I bent I broke I <laughs> oh bent you the were lid. you were inside of the toy yeah, box yeah the lid bent because it's just plastic Jesus yeah doesn't support a flailing child I guess all right then should we do a thing where we also try to analyze what we think these dreams mean I mean or should we just share to. them no I mean if you want to okay what do you think your walrus 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 dream meant not a clue I was like four. <laughs> It was, it. I, I probably just learned what a walrus was. So probably I, it was. It was the. It was the. Uh, it was a child needing to grow up, and that's why gotcha. there was a ladder. And growing up was so far because the ladder went into oblivion. But I had yeah. all these problems uh, with walruses. Go on. Yeah, that's. Do know. do walruses scare you, or did they scare you? No. Oh. Uh-huh. I've always kind of been a little scared of walruses. walruses. Uh, yeah, I've, I think they're kind of creepy looking. I, I've they've got been, giant fucking bony tusks coming out their mouth. Yeah. I think it's creepy. <laughs> they're a little weird looking. Yeah. It's just a giant blob with tusks. Yeah. Uh, I've, I've induced dreams where I thought about something so hard mm-hmm. that I wanted to dream about. Uh, I actually dreamed about it. Um, I was I, I really liked Ocarina of Time. That was around when I was like uh-huh. nine. Mm-hmm. So I, I really wanted to be Link. So I just kept thinking about it, and I had yeah. a dream about me being Link. Really? It was amazing. Damn it, I've tried to do the same thing and failed miserably. I remember like coming straight out of high school, I met this girl, and I like, fell madly in love you with her. You just wanted a boner? And, and yeah, came. and before going to bed for like an hour, I was just thinking about her. I was just like, oh, God, I love this girl. Like, please. And, and then that night, I dreamt about like fucking insects coming out of my eyeballs <laughs> or some shit. Like, I was like, well, that's disappointing. Well, you can't, you can't have a wet dream about a girl if you've rubbed one out before you fell asleep. I didn't. I just I thought about her a lot before going to bed. Let's open this up to... The the uh, community now. I think we've shared enough about our minds. So pod is open. So guys, go ahead. If you'd like to share a dream with us um, or nightmare, you can share a nightmare. Nightmare. I didn't say nightmare. Shh. Um, just try not to be too uh, bleak. I guess. Bleak. Let's try and keep things a little positive. I guess. I had one dream where I was falling, and right before I hit the floor, because mm-hmm. I was falling from like really really high Mm -hmm. it the floor opened up and i went into another place it was crazy what the fuck yeah this is weird like you can't die in dreams so that just means you're a fucking badass and you're super brave because everybody else would freak out and shit their pants when they hit the ground but you were just like nah i'm still rolling (laughs) shit beyond this let's keep this shit going (laughs) all right let's see who's uh who's who's gonna be first yes guys do not pot in more than once once you've potted you are in uh who's on first sam utile Tim you too, no? No, that was never mind. Sorry, that wait, was Zalo. Wait, where's where's my butt? Where's my butt at? Oh my god, his body broken? No. Body ain't broken. Body's probably broken. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh my god. Hold Mo- on. Moof, you're gonna have to edit this. Body. This is your first podcast. Yeah, this is uh, how it usually okay. goes. You know what I did? I added moderators to the whole podcast thing, and I bet you that's that's tripping it out. So we're gonna go old school with this. Okay. And Brett's going to pick at random. Okay. Here's what we're going to do. Roll a number. Because pod is fucking up right now, and we're in the middle of a podcast, so we don't have time to fix it, um, I'm going to... How many people do we have in the chat? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Okay. That's a nice round number. Random number generator. <laughs> <laughs> and then so what we'll do is we'll do 1 through 20 and if you do not want to talk to us 
then just say no when we say, hey, we're calling on you. Okay? So, 1 to 20. Number 14. Oh, geez. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Move. Move. All move. right. You we're unmuting you. You want to talk move? Okay. Move. Pro- I'm sure move wants to talk. I'm All not. sorts of Sea Scouts dreams. I've got a... Do I add the role to him? Yeah, let's add the role to him. I should have the moderators do this. Yeah. Podcast guest. There it is. Get a podcast guest. Cool. And then you have to stick him in another channel and then bring him back. Okay. No, he's still, he's still muted. No, he muted himself. Are you positive about that? Yes. Someone manually unmute you? We did manually unmute you. I can't undo can't undo it help help <laughs> oh wait wait i got you I, I got you i got you i know how to do this <laughs> you're not going to be a moderator for a short amount of time <laughs> <laughs> that works okay so moderators we're gonna not give you your power no no still not <clears throat> move what did you do oh this is the roll stuff what he just think? disappeared no he didn't oh he left Let's try uh, another person. Yeah. See how it goes. Yeah. Rest in peace, Move my Hey, there he is. Oh, hi, Move. It was. It wasn't letting me unselect it for some reason. Oh, that's oh. bizarre. Well, this is gonna be a weird one, but this is how we're gonna do this podcast. Hey. Oh, this is gonna be fun. All right. So hit hit us with it. What? What? You got a saucy dream for us? Um, actually, my first dream that I remember, um, yeah. back in... This is the Zombie I like that one. Zombie Brew. Oh. Wait, which one? Hold up. Elmo! <laughs> Why is Elmo here? Elmo. Okay, sorry. What the fuck okay. just happened? <laughs> Wait, hold on. Somebody else is... Okay. I got it. Okay, go on, Move. I don't know what just happened. Oh, <laughs> that was weird. Oh. <laughs> um. Body came back to life. Was, uh... <laughs> go on. <laughs> This was a dream back from when I was a kindergartner. Okay. Um, off, I was running through this field, what being chased by. Okay, so so you know the movie Aliens, of course, right? Correct, of course. Xenomorphs. What? It was like xenomorph tails following me through the ground. Ooh, interesting. Resident Wait, Evil Wait, you went through style. the ground? No, I was running. They were, like, sticking up from the ground, chasing me. Yeah, so oh. he's, like, running and, like, tails are, like, spiking up out of the ground. Going, pow, 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 pow. <laughs> Did That's you have problems badass. running where you couldn't run as fast as you wanted to run? I was, like, totally badass. Oh, okay. I've had those, too. So it wasn't really a nightmare because you came out on top, no. right? No, well, it, that's not where it ends. That's I mean, like that the, That's, like, the start. <laughs> huh. <laughs> so then uh, I was saved by Goofy. Goofy. From yeah. Mickey Mouse. Did yeah. he did he look like an alien? Like alien <laughs> like goofy. Kingdom Hearts style goofy. Like opened his mouth and another little one of him came yeah. out. Was he in a spacesuit <laughs> with a fucking ray gun? <laughs> just Should like a yuck. <laughs> it's pretty dope. Okay, so Goofy comes and save you. What what happened after that? Uh, I get taken to this pyramid all of a sudden. Okay. Um and I'm turned into a fish. Yeah. Yeah. As you <clears> do. Uh, you know, normal, normal stuff. Yeah. The rest of the dream, I'm spent as this fish trying to figure out a way to break myself out and kill whoever turned me into this fish, which turned out to be this guy who looked like Binks or some shit. Okay. Interesting. That's a really, like... Were you were you on, like, a movie <laughs> marathon that day no, or something? No, surprisingly not. I, I, I don't think so, at least. I was going to say, you've got, like, really, really good memory um, for something that happened when you were five years old. Considering I can't even remember most of my dreams five minutes after they've happened. <laughs> it's like the only... Some of them commit. Old, old dream that I... Well, there's two old dreams that I remember, but, like, that was, like, the big one. That I just, like, when I think of memorable dreams, that's the first one that really comes to mind for me. Yeah, I can imagine why. I mean, it sounds badass, and I hope someone commits it to film one day. <laughs> <laughs> Give us the film rights. All right. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So, in the next scene, Goofy will drop from a tree yeah. and <laughs> the xenomorph tails away I, uh, before turning him 
to a fish. Yeah, but I, I get the rights to play Goofy. That's that's my course, only that's my know, only uh, stipulation, of course. <laughs> Who else would play Goofy? I don't know, like Bill Farmer, maybe. <laughs> I mean, you could play Minnie. Uh, no, that's you know what? No, next caller. <laughs> next, <laughs> I'm offended. <laughs> All right, no, thanks for the call, Move. Thanks, Move. All right, all right. Uh, do your your roll thing again. Oh yes, uh, I think it's more than twenty at this point, but. We'll just do it again. Number four. Number four. One, two, three, four. Is he uh, Bryant? Mark, would you Bryant. like to speak with us? Bryant, Mark, would you like to join? Did you pod? Are you there? Mm, going once, going twice, going three times. Moving he, on. Dead. Uh, number five. Number five. Cameroon. 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 You there? You wanna? You wanna join? Cameroon, did you did you yes. want to talk? Or yes. Uh, okay, cool. All right, All right. we're I'm unmuting meeting. you. Hello, can you hear us? Hello. Hey, hello. what's up? We can hear you. Well, hello. Hello. I what have a rather mortifying dream to share. Good. Really That's my favorite kind, actually. <laughs> but I actually kind of have to go quick. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, go go fast. Gotta as, go fast. Well, if any of you don't know, me and um, Pigeon were friends, IRL. Yes. And yes. I usually stay up late playing video games okay and we usually play battlefield together or warframe or something but um i remember i forget what exactly i did but i pissed him off a lot and then i fell asleep in my gaming chair but i forgot i fell asleep and in my dream i heard a creak behind me and i turned around and it was him and he was just standing there staring at me in my fucking bedroom okay and, and i almost shit myself and then he threw masking tape at my face and i woke up <laughs> okay <laughs> I'm close to positive that was not a there's, dream. It was real life. Yes. I'm pretty sure that happened. <laughs> well, the masking tape can be traced back to when I threw him, and he beat the shit out of me. Oh. Oh. Yeah, that's. I mean, that's a, that's a valid reason to beat the shit out of somebody. What were you thinking throwing tape at somebody? <laughs> well, um, honestly, I was trying to fake him out, but I'm bad at that, and uh. I let go. Hit him in the face. See, I, <laughs> I, I think that that wasn't a dream. I think maybe you're remembering it as a dream. You might have had some sort of, um, what are what are those those uh, hip uh, hypnosis? Maybe not hallucination, but like you you you've been hypnotized to remember these these suppressed memories. <laughs> and Battlefield One has hypnotized me. Hmm. Uh, that you wouldn't know be of. the first time. You're getting very sleepy. But regardless, it freaked me the fuck out. Yeah, I, I, I'd be freaked out too. I don't know what Pidge looks like, but um, it, it, yeah, it, it's. Um, <laughs> You're just gonna go like, into it. <laughs> probably a foot taller than you and very masculine. Uh, muscular. I think I'm taller than him, but I know, but I'm extremely short. <laughs> okay. So oh, <laughs> gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, sounds horrifying, Slender Man. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> cool. All right, thanks for the call, Cameron. Thanks, man. Yeah, sure. All right, talk to you later. All right. Can I can I real quick before we get somebody? Can I turn the light on in here? Yeah, please. Yeah, all right. I'll be right back, guys. Sorry. It's, the sun's going down. Yeah. The sun's getting real low. As it does, and it's it got kind of dark in here. It's a little dark. Ugh. I it, it's making it difficult to see Brett, and I always have to keep an eye on him because it's, it's there Brett. We go. <laughs> oh, that's nice. Now I can see your beautiful face. Thank you. And more importantly, I can look at the screen without getting a fucking migraine. Yeah. All, All right, back to the podcast. Too. All right, do another roll for me. Uh, yeah, that's right. I forgot. Roll for me, baby. I have a job. <laughs> who, who, who? They pay me the big bucks to do this. Uh, number thirteen. Thirteen should be Maddie Neko if if Moof was fourteen. So yes. Maddie, Maddie, would you like to speak or would you like to just listen? All right, Maddie is talking. We're gonna go ahead and unmute you. Unmuting. Hold on. Wait. 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 Give us right above. There you go. Here we go. Let's just bleep, bleep. All right. I think you have your mic muted. If you wanna, if you wanna unmute, say hello. Oh, and Bryant said he wants to talk, so we'll we'll pot him in after this. Okay. Maddie, I, I, it seems like you're muted on your end. All we see is Pidge and Cameron having a conversation. Hello. Hey, Maddie. Hello. hello. How's it going, man? It's awesome to finally talk to you. Yeah. So, uh, what's up? You got a dream? Do you have uh, a dream? Yeah, actually, uh, I have a really weird one. Let's hear it. Well, I kind of had, like, sleep paralysis. So, this one time, Ooh. I was, like, having sleep paralysis, and there was a, like, weird woman 
eating my foot. Oh, fuck, dude. The, dude what kind yeah, of weird woman? The was horrifying she like... way, right? <laughs> <laughs> was she was she an old no. lady? Was she was she a ghost lady? Was she a zombie? Um, was she a, a vampiress? Was she someone you knew? No. Okay. I mean, well, okay. So so just so sleep paralysis is where you're like, you can see around, but but you're like locked in place, right? Or is that something else? Oh, uh, yeah, I believe so. Okay, so you could like see yourself in your bed, but there's just like some creepy lady. Like so e was, eating your foot? It was sleep sleep paralysis. Yes. That sounds fucking Dream horrifying, sleep dude. Paralysis. Yeah. I've heard stories of people oh. that have that and like they'll they'll be in their bed and they can see and like the sleep paralysis makes them see like somebody come up and just screaming in their face for like an hour straight. It's yeah. like that that sounds like something I would not want to do ever. Yeah, I, I mean, mean it's good as not your also choice, having but. your foot eaten kind of is paralyzing. <laughs> Yes. No, you do that's, at that point. I'm, well, I mean, that's that's fine with me. What you, do you just what do you really make need eye you? contact, and then she stops, and you're like, "Go on." What do you, what do you really need your feet for? Uh, quite a few things. Nah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He agrees. Damn it, Maddie! I need you to get my back on this. It's my back. <laughs> All right. Awesome. Well, that was an interesting one. Uh, I'm sorry to hear that you have sleep paralysis. <laughs> I think it was a sleep paralysis in the dream. Was oh sleep man. Sleep paralysis. I'm confused. No, I got over it, so... Okay, cool. Oh, good. That's good. Then everybody's better. <laughs> good. Thanks for the call, man. Yep. Thanks, man. You're welcome. Bye, bye, bye. All right. As Justin Timberlake would say. <laughs> you roll me again. I'm rolling. Chill the fuck. <laughs> we got number six. Number six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Char Lizard Burns. You would there? you like to speak, sire? Would you like to join us? Move. Oh, Bryant. Bryant. Hold on. Hold up, Char Lizard. We're going to do Bryant first. Wait, where? Where are we at? Oh, there we are. Brian, are you there? I need a, I need a text confirmation. Just like a... Fira, you can pot in. The pot is still open. Well, you can't pot in, but you can... You can. Oh, well, oh yeah, that's <laughs> yeah. a good point. All right, you're unmuted. Hello. Hello, Brian. Hello. Hey, Hi. how's it going? Yes. Yeah. Oh, hey. Um, yeah. Um... To be honest, I don't really dream that much. Same. Like, yeah, I, I don't remember it. Uh, the most I ever get is just like, like I'll just like be falling, mm -hmm. and then I'll just like wake up. So that's it. All right. Yeah. I mean, that happens that's to a lot of people. Do have they ever yeah. figured out <laughs> what that actually means when you're? Is that is that like? I think everybody has it. Really, there's not like. Yeah. There's one of the things where like this means that you're scared of your your finances, and this means that. Your no. relationships are going wrong. No, I think everybody just has a fear of falling. It's, it's like uh, except you, for you, apparently. Well, yeah, I just make the floor open into the next <laughs> world. <laughs> but but uh, maybe yeah, most people. I mean, a lot of people have a fear of heights. And also, like if you closed your eyes and started to lean forward, or like if you're holding your head up while you're like napping, oh uh, yeah, and you yeah, slip little, and you like, like jerk around. I had that happen to me this that, morning. It's that same feeling. I fell asleep in the shower. How? Standing How up, <laughs> yeah. In the morning, I was, I was maybe this is why you standing. have dreams of water all the time. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it, was, it was rough. I woke up and my knees like locked, and I felt my feet snap. I was like, "Holy shit!" <laughs> all right. hey, thanks for the call, Brian. Thanks, man. Yeah, yeah. See ya. See it. All right. All right. Next up, uh, we're still at twenty. I counted wait, while wait, we were no, doing that. No, no, no. We got who was it? Uh, Charlie. Oh, Charlie Lizard. Oh, Char -Lizard. Are you there? Char well, we never got confirmation from Charlie Lizard. Yeah, oh, he's there. You yeah, want to join? You want to talk? You want to talk, man? You want you want you want to talk? I'm assuming you want to have a conversation with us, man. You want to talk? Hey. He's gonna say no. You yes, he said up. yes. Okay, cool. Yes, hey, I can what's hear you. up? Hi. Okay. Uh, so I have a couple things if I got time for it. So I don't get a lot of dreams. Yep. Uh huh. But I do talk in my sleep all the time. Dope. And one of my favorites. I had a roommate for about three months who lived in my room with me. Mm-hmm. And I still live at my parents' house, so my parents are just used to it. They don't even tell me about what happens anymore. Right. My roommate, I scared the shit out of him. Okay. <laughs> I just rolled over, opened my eyes, looked at him, said, hey. He was like, what's up, man? <laughs> and I just screamed really <laughs> loud at him. Just, ah, really loud at him. I don't think oh, that man. qualifies as sleep talking, man. I no. think and then I rolled back over and just... Closed my eyes and said, 
Man, it's fucking game over, man. I'm telling you, it's fucking game <laughs> over, man. So, it's done. so you don't and just pass the fuck out again. I don't remember it, but he told me he was terrified. <laughs> you don't sleep talk, you sleep Bill Paxton, as they say. Hey, my <laughs> references go over everybody's ass. Hey, but, yeah. Uh, I do have one dream. Most of the time, uh, I do yeah. dream about like whatever is going on. I have dreams about Pizza Hut where mm -hmm. I work and uh, just constant things that are going on in my life. Yeah. But after I saw Avengers, I had a vivid dream, and it was like 15 minutes of just nonstop craziness. The, had, the newest there was Avengers. Like a ghost haunting my house, and I had to grab like rings from all my family members and beat the ghost into submission. <laughs> Yeah, sure. And it was 15 minutes of just nonstop, just ridiculous. No, that's good though. That nonsense. means that means that that you're brave, because most people, <laughs> when they're being chased by ghosts in their dreams, they're shitting their pants and running. But you were fighting <laughs> in them. real life. Well, yeah, in real life too. <laughs> No, I mean, in your dreams, when I see a ghost, I'm like, no, fuck that shit. I'm oh out. man, Brett mentioned the joke. The joke was, you dream yeah. about that, yeah. and you're shitting and running in real life. Oh, I see. There you go. Good job. Well, no, but uh, it was just, and Beth's <laughs> saying something about night terrors in the chat, but yeah. no, I remember all my nightmares. They're all really stupid things, but for whatever reason, they scare me. Yeah, that is sort of the 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 thing about nightmares is usually they're not as scary as as you think they are. I, I remember as a oh, kid yeah, being horrified of a dream that I had where I was just being chased around by a shirt, just a floating shirt, <laughs> but it was like like I was scared for oh, like a week. A it was, it was freaky, like man. Week? Yeah, it was just like this, like this shirt that just followed me around and didn't ever do anything. It just was always behind me. I, was like, oh, I think that's fucking creepy. Wait, I mean, that'd be a ghost. That opens really. up another question. Do you have like reoccurring dreams as I, well? I used to a lot, not much anymore. But uh, I used to have, no. um, again, with my fear of water, uh, a, a very recurring dream when I was like a teenager was. Uh, being on a beach and then a giant fucking tsunami wave comes and swallows the beach. That's happened. I've never had a recurring dream. Probably dozens of times in my life I've had that same dream. Hmm. Yeah, I think I think I might be psychic, and that might be how I die. <laughs> uh, could be. <laughs> hey, if, as long as it's on an island. No, yeah, yeah, sure, water yes. is a really common one in dreams. Uh, I used yeah. to do dream analysis with some friends back right. in the day. So I know that a lot of people have the floating dream, and that's a bunch of stuff with their mom. Well, then, I have oh, dreams with my mom, too, if you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next game. Thanks for the call, Charlie. All right. Have a good one, guys. Talk to you, man. Did I ever tell you about the guy who was having a, a dream and he sleepwalks and then he peed all over everyone in the den? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Hold on, I'm retelling this. <laughs> tell me the story. Well, I'm going to let you count. Okay, it's, who, still it's still 20. It's still 20. Yeah, it's still 20. Uh... <laughs> 15 so, so we're at uh, pumpkin so it was a uh, pumpkin was, let us know if you want to talk it was it was a camp thing mm -hmm. and uh we were talking to this kid about sharks okay, cool. and uh i guess it scared him or something uh -huh. um and then we were in a tent we got we got the big tent we're like okay. six six to eight boys in there yeah, yeah and uh he like stood up he like sat up and yeah he was we got panicking. you pumpkin. and yeah. he was panicking looking around and then uh like it woke me up uh -huh. and i was like Dude, you all right? And then it woke everyone else up. Uh -huh. And then he stood up, and he didn't have any pants somehow. <laughs> and he, started, he was spraying everybody. Oh, my God. I was oh. Like, I was like, Dude. I, like, I hid under the... In, in, I, I hid in the sleeping bag for cover. But, yeah, it was, oh, it was pretty crazy. He's my hero. He was dreaming about sharks or something. We scared the shit... Well, we scared the piss out of him. Yeah. Oh, yeah, apparently. And then he, and then he stopped. And he laid back down and went to sleep. <laughs> it's like, no, you don't get to go back to sleep and after that. Everybody was just like, what do we do? Yeah, oh, Jesus. What do we do at this point? Yeah, that's that's rough. That's crazy uh, stuff. Pumpkin did say he wanted to talk, so we'll we'll bring him in. All right, all right. Like, he brought himself in. Hey, what's no, up? No, I think some one of the mods let him in. Welcome, welcome, Pumpkin. We can hear you. Hello. Hi. Hello. How's it going, man? Pretty good. Awesome. You got any dreams or nightmares or... Saucy, sexy dreams you'd like to share? I actually have a dream that involves you two nerds. Oh, God. Oh, I can't wait. Let's hear it. What was Brett doing? Um, so here's the strange thing. Yeah. So it involved Brent being in a band. Okay. <laughs> okay. 
So we're already off to a bad start. Um, <laughs> I was in a few bands. And That's true. I was at a random coffee shop somewhere in America for no reason. Okay. And then randomly Brent in a band walks in. Okay. And starts playing. <laughs> and Brett is also in the audience. Um, hmm. So I'm watching the band play and I'm like, hmm, this is pretty good. But this seems to be a bit strange. I think I'm misremembering this, but I don't know. <laughs> so then um, it kind of goes on and eventually the concert ends. And I follow and start touring with Brent's band as a roadie. Oh, nice. Awesome. And I like carry equipment and stuff. Uh -huh. And it's it was a very strange dream. Awesome. So I just yeah. kind of ended up touring with a brand that, with a band that Brent was in. That does sound pretty cool. I will say it's a bit unrealistic. I would never be there supporting Brent in let's, anything. Let's make this a real thing. <laughs> let's make this a thing. <laughs> I, I mean, Brent will be the driver. <laughs> I guess. Well, no, apparently... That's the reason you were in the I'm audience. You weren't supporting. Apparently, I'm the fucking groupie. <laughs> <laughs> According to Pumpkin's Dream. I like it. This yeah, I guess that, that is pretty accurate. <laughs> and what else would I do? All right. You'd be a driver. Well, thanks for the call, Pumpkin. That was, um... Hit, hit close to home. I like it. Thanks. Okay, bye. <laughs> All, All right, right, you got oh, another God role? damn it, I'm sorry. I keep forgetting. Man, you're met... You Shut your ass! You are... You, you have one roll, and that is to roll... Uh, I just got the same number again. Just keep doing it. Keep rolling. Uh, seven! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's Dan. Dan, Dan you want to talk? Dan, Daniel! <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Dan, oh no, Dan. Wait, okay, listen, listen here. here. Does that mean yes? <laughs> Dan, do you want to talk or not? <laughs> Is that a yes? <laughs> Give us a yes or no. Yes, oh, it was okay. mine. Okay, cool. <clears throat> All right. Danny? Hello. Hello. Hey, what's up, man? Hi, we can hear you. How's it going? It's going pretty well. Awesome. Um, I have a dream that I have not spoken with anyone about. Okay. And this was like when I was like five. Okay. So this was, um, we have I ever mentioned that I lived on a uh, big ass farm back when I was in um, Florida? I do recall that. All right, cool. Well, this was in that house. So... Um, I was in my room in this dream because mm -hmm. these these dreams that I have recall like a lot of real life portions. Yeah. So I was in my room and we have a china cabinet beside my room that we have in our house now. And I walked out of my room, went over the fence, and this big ass green arm came out of the china cabinet, reached oh. for me. It was quite muscular. Jeez. And so <laughs> that that's how I remember it. So I backed up, and then I fell back into uh, what seemed to be a trap door in the dining room. Yeah. That led into a blue net kind of thing underneath the house, like 50 feet deep, all sorts of weird shit. There was a whole bunch of people in there that I don't know, but I remember that I was reaching for a Thomas the Tank Engine toy, and then I woke up. Oh. That's about it. <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell you what that means, but that has stuck with me for Wait, years. Thomas the Train? Yeah, Thomas. Yes. He's in everything. Thomas the Tank Engine, because he's a fucking tank, dude. Yeah. Y yeah. You can join my, over <laughs> my Overwatch squad. <laughs> why, why, it's a squad need, of one. I don't have anybody else. <laughs> well, that was interesting. I don't really know what to make of that, Dan. That was... <laughs> <laughs> I, I think no, it made I... itself. <laughs> yeah. It, if any, I guess we now have another um, potential movie to make. Yeah. So, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Definitely. So yeah. Secretly, I'll, uh, I'll we. Give you the rights for that. Yeah. Secretly, we're only running this podcast so that we can get some movie pitches. Yeah. Basically. Uh, that, yeah. That makes sense. <laughs> cool. I, I, I think it'd sell well as like a uh, knockoff kind of movie. Awesome, man. Uh, then right, I guess man. thanks for the call. Uh, All right. And keep keep an eye on the, the, the keep those dreams tri happening. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, keep sure. dreaming, keep man. Keep dreaming. Don't It'll stop happen. dreaming. <clears throat> All right. Let, again. All right. We're going to roll again. All right. Thanks. All right. All right. Rolling and 11. Uh, one, two, three, three four, four, five, six, six seven, seven, eight, nine, eight, nine, nine, ten, eleven. Ham Cam Slam Jam. Ham Cam Slam Jam. Would you like to talk? Say Would yeah? you like to talk, Ham Cam Slam Jam? Or if you'd like to just listen, that's totally. Why no? <laughs> why no? Okay. That's that fine. You don't have to talk. That's totally fine. All right. Let's do one, two, rolling, rolling, three. Zero, one, two, three. Blue. Blue. Blue, would you like to talk? <clears throat> blue. Ham blue. Oh, he said, why not? We'll come back to you. Oh, then. okay. We'll come back to you, Ham Cam. 
Yeah, we'll just wait and see if uh, Blue wants to talk. In Blue, would you like to talk with us? We have lots of stuff in our butts. <laughs> Is that the incentive? <laughs> <laughs> Nope, you're a mute in real life. Oh, okay, no worries then. Then we will go ahead and go straight to Ham Cam Slam Jam. All right. Ham Cam Slam Jam. Ham Cam, do you have a mic? Can you hear us? Yeah. Hey, what's up? Awesome. Hello. Not much. Cool. Um, I guess as we guys were talking about sleep paralysis, I remember one yeah. of my dreams. Okay. Uh, one of them was just like really weird. I just remember trying to wake up and trying to move. And then just out of nowhere, I just see like 10 people around me. I felt like I was in like a doctor's office mm -hmm. and just people with like little masks that just had like just smiley faces, like straight up just stabbed my whole body. And I don't remember what happened next. I just couldn't move again. And I got so terrified. Whoa. Jesus. It's like my only weird dream. Uh, geez. I got so scared. scared. Yeah, dude, that's just. Let's that, hope it's not a memory. That's just a fucking memory in disguise. Terrible, man. Like, I feel so bad. <laughs> what were they doing? They just. Deal with that. They're just so, staring they, with masks? They just, they, uh, yeah, they just felt like I was doing it for like hours. I got was terrified, woke up and just said, nope, no, and I just <laughs> stay awake for the rest of the night. <laughs> yeah, I just oh. watch YouTube. God, dude, <laughs> you guys. I do not envy you. I mean, yeah. hey, man, we live in, and we, we live. <laughs> Thanks, Brent. <Yeah. laughs> so... Words of wisdom. I'm going to put everything you say into a book one day, Thanks. but I'm not going to. All I'm right. going to put it online so I don't have to print it. <laughs> well, thanks for the call, Ham. Um, Jesus, I have I have the, uh, what do you call that when you get, like, the pricklies from the fucking... Uh, goosebumps. Uh, I guess goosebumps, kind of. It's more like like, sp like spikies in the back of Oh, you of mean the neck. hair? Yeah, that's Your the one. Raises, yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Your hair raises. Whatever that is, but... You got that. Damn you. <laughs> thanks. All right, next call. Rolling, 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 rolling. We keep a rolling, 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 rolling. Number 18. Oh, geez. <clears throat> One, two, three, four. I can just go. This is 20, right? Yeah, yeah. 1918. Surprise, Surprise. Nekoist. Would you like to speak with us, Surprise Nekoist? Yes. Yes, all right. You are, you are available for talking. Can you hear us, and can we hear you? Say something, child. Yes, I can. Hey, oh, awesome. what's up? Hello, and welcome to the podcast. Okay. So I've got a story for you guys. Let's hear it. Can't well, wait. dream. dream. My 17 years that I've been alive. Yeah. Is I had a dream that I was in like a. Okay, it was sort of like a carnival, but um, I was being chased by a clown that had a butcher knife. Jeez. Don't ask me why. Oh. This was. <laughs> oh. Yeah, clown, clowns, okay. clowns, clowns are fucked, dude. You, you get wait. Not this that was bad. wait. This was in the dream or this was in real life? Sorry. Oh, okay. No, this was a dream. Oh, okay, 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 all. okay. <laughs> I was running from the clown. Uh huh. And I somehow managed to find a picture frame that had a picture, and I jumped into the picture frame like in Mario sixty four. I was somehow. about to say you've been playing too much Mario sixty four. Dope. No, that's badass. Dude. That's awesome. <laughs> So you so that wait so that was how you escaped from the clown or or did it take you somewhere else like in Mario sixty four? Um, the last part I remember is just the clown walking up and then I woke up. <laughs> he oh. actually jumped into the picture, but it just took him to the other side of the frame. <laughs> <laughs> He's just like both in there. Fuck! Now 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 I've just ruined this painting. Just <laughs> 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 oh, <it's okay. laughs> the oh, clown cool. was actually a curator at a museum. And he's like, yeah. "What are you doing?" He's like, "I'm so getting fired for this <laughs> shit." <laughs> All right, cool. Hey, thanks. thanks, thanks for the call, man. You're welcome. I'll talk to you later. All right. All right. Do more rolls. Keep rolling, rolling, rolling. I'm just gonna do limp biscuit now every single time when I hit the roll. Okay. Number two. Number two. One two. Alish. Alish. Uh, mm -hmm. Oh, I think I remember her saying that she didn't have uh, a mic. Wait, okay, no, okay, yeah. Sorry, mic. sorry, sorry. That's okay. We are going to it's move just on. Brett's random number. Yeah, generator. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, man. <laughs> All right, we are looking at eleven. Did we already do eleven? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yeah, that was ham. Yeah, we already yeah. did ham. Okay, let's just see who haven't we done that would still like to talk, so that I have like a, a group to pull from. Because now I'm just okay. So we got. Uh, we got Sam, Beth, just say me once! Jesus Christ, guys! <laughs> Sam, Beth, Wolf, Fira, Harvin, uh, 
uh, okay, that's not too many people. So let's just let's just Elmo. go down the line. Elmo. Oh, and Elmo. Elmo. <laughs> just say me. <laughs> okay, let's just go down the list. Let's just let's just get those last people in, and then All right. and then, uh, then who is good. first? Uh, so we're going first? down. Uh, DJ Fira. DJ Fira. DJ Fira. Hello. You are unmuted. Yay! Oh my oh, God! Jesus. Hold on. Let me turn <laughs> down. Turn you down. Let me turn down my mixer. <laughs> How, <laughs> how's it going? I do it all right. Awesome. That's good. What kinds of? I have of, many oh. dreams. Oh, I have cool. a selection for you guys to choose from. Okay, give us co- like a short synopsis, and then we'll pick for the <laughs> for which one we want. <laughs> we need tag one line. is Halo themed. Another one is NSFW, which I'm probably not going to choose. Another one is horror themed, and then the other one is. Weird memories. I choose NSFW. She said she's probably not into. <laughs> Wait, uh, did you say the first one was Halo themed? Yeah, let's do the Halo themed one. <laughs> okay, so in this dream was when I suddenly somehow through a portal appeared in this weird weird world. Yeah. Video game style. You were apparently yeah, the center ruler of the rebellion, and in the rebellion, it's very RPG Halo themed style. You get to see your stats, items that you have, as well as apparently quote unquote superpowers. Awesome. That you're battling through a mall in order to get out away from apparently the apocalypse, which the apocalypse consists of inanimate objects appearing to be alive and threatening and wanting to kill everyone. Jesus. <laughs> can, can I just say, uh, Fira, we've talked to you multiple times and every time you have a very cute, soft voice. And for some reason, when you're talking about Halo, you're, like, <laughs> you're screaming at us. <laughs> <laughs> so pumped about it. You get that feeling. It's awesome. Uh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> no, no, yeah, there no, it is. No. That's the one that I'm No, no, no. <laughs> no, thank you. Uh, Moose says I'm she gets so very outside. serious about Halo. <laughs> <laughs> I will say I've, I've had dreams like that where, like, you can see, like, your stats and shit, like, while you're in the dream, and those are always the best. It's you're like, like yeah, yeah, dude, I'm so fucking high level. I've never seen that. Really? It must be. Um, what happened is that, as the center person, I was trying to battle things out. I was apparently shot down, and then at one health, and then someone was trying to heal me. Mm-hmm. And then out of nowhere, in the middle of the mall, because apparently you're now stuck in a mall, a giant jumpy house. Yeah. <laughs> can arrange itself to be a giant balloon dinosaur. Okay, so. And apparently, the skin is impenetrable. But we. And then it swallowed me. Oh. Crushing me, and I woke up feeling my throat was crushed. Oh, so it was a bouncy house that turned into a dinosaur. <laughs> I think I have an idea. <laughs> well, what's something? Is something dinosaur. we can make? <laughs> yeah, all right. Um, were you able to get inside the bouncy house? No, he's crushing her. It swallowed me. Yeah. It swallowed you. Yeah. Well, I mean, good. What do you mean, good? <laughs> Problem solved. You're trying to get inside a bouncy house. It, You're inside it, the bouncy yeah, house. Yeah, if it chooses to eat you, that's you don't even have to move. <laughs> it does all the work. Yeah, yeah exactly. It's like a crushed throat. Yeah, you know what? A small price to pay for, <laughs> for, for a, a fun bouncy. time in a bouncy <laughs> castle. <laughs> Dinosaur shaped bouncy Move, castle. No. Shut up. <laughs> Moofy, no. Wait, what's up? Moof, no. Oh, uh, what did Moofy say? Oh, no. He said vor. Oh, Moof's trying to go vor. <laughs> God damn it, Moof. Keep it PG. Yeah, no, like we do. Yeah, every day. exactly. <laughs> every single episode. This is a a PG channel. YouTube yeah, family channel. Family friendly. <laughs> All right. Well, that was interesting. Thanks, Thanks for the call, Fira. That's another movie that we'll have to make. <laughs> we're keep, we're we're writing these down. <laughs> Thanks a lot. We'll talk to you later. <laughs> Thanks. All right. Who is next? Next on was list? Elmo. 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 So, are you at the ready? Hold on. Hello? What? Hold on, hold oh, on, wait, on, why did he just come? Elmo! Hey. <laughs> yeah, we're here. Hey, what's up? Hey, how you doing, man? Doing Good, all how right. are you? I heard a loud laugh. <laughs> oh, that's my buddy. Nice. Sup, Elmo's buddy? Sup, Elmo's buddy? <laughs> you wanna... I'm here with my buddy. We're, we're, we're buddies? A couple different buddies. Yeah. Aww. Well, yeah, we're voice my buddies. Dream was, my dream was, I was also, I was young. And uh, we had just gotten a new couch for the family, uh-huh. and a pull-out couch. I don't know if you're familiar with pull-out couches, yep. but when you pull it out, you can pull the headrest up, uh-huh. you know, like that, as a little extra pillow. Well, there's a gap there, and you can slide down in there. Yep. You can hide <laughs> in there or whatever. Right. Well, I decided to sleep there that night. Yeah. Well, I closed it up and went to sleep, had a dream that I was stuck in a coffin, was screaming and <laughs> flailing, hitting, and, and, in, and also in reality, I was swinging my arms around 
Yeah. And if you're familiar with the inside of a couch at all, it's pretty much just springs and metal. Yeah. So I cut myself up pretty good. Whew. Ended up, my brother ran out, uh, was trying to find me, had no idea where I was. <laughs> Pulled it up, woke me up, and got me out. Pretty anticlimactic, but, I, you know, I was, I was cut up pretty good. You know, no stitches or anything, but that's pretty much the story. Hey, man. Oh, man. The, 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 yeah, the story and the dream. My grandma had one of those couches. Oh. Uh, I had one of those couches. You went into the little back area? Well, well, it has all the springs just fucking sticking yeah. out. Yep, uh, yep, yeah. yep. They don't hey, make them so like that anymore. They're hiding there all the time. This yeah. is actually <laughs> Elmo's buddy. Here's Elmo. Yeah, I was gonna say that's not Elmo hey, talking. Hey, hey, how's it going? Hey, what's up? There was a. Hey, I was. Uh, I was saying. I was like, hey, uh, when uh, they call me up, uh, just start talking like you're on my account, and <laughs> okay. it'll work perfect. <laughs> no, I noticed immediately that it wasn't you, but I was like, I was do like, I correct it or do I just? I just we're just doing, talking to this. You're doing a voice. <laughs> silent. Yeah. Just I could I could see you guys sitting there, and be like, that's not his voice at <laughs> yeah, all. Yeah, we we're really <laughs> thinking about it. Yeah, it's okay. I mean, hey, we'll talk to anybody. Yeah, I didn't have any stories, so I thought I'd join okay. my friends in podcasts, and awesome. we've been loving it so far. Well, we appreciate that, man. Yeah, thanks for joining. We we will talk to and, uh, you and your friendly. Oh, what's up? What's up? Oh, I was yeah, I, I I I was I love seeing you guys have so much fun at that controller. I was glad I was able to. Make oh it. Yeah. Oh hell yeah. That was awesome. Yeah, and yeah, was- for everyone else, Elmo may have some plans for another modded controller, maybe. Yes, that is that is uh, in the far future. I'm not looking too super yeah. soon. Yeah, yeah. But I have an idea for a second one. Yes, it's gonna nice. be dope. It's gonna be I'll dope. Include both of you D-O-P-E. guys. Yeah, and like, we're no spoilers, yeah. but yes, be uh, on the horizon. Brent's excited. Already. I'm very excited. Yeah, I mean, okay. Brent's the only one who can actually see how excited I am because he's the only one who can see below my waist right now. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and his, you, both his hands are down there. The controller better than I did when I was testing it. I'll tell you that. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> well, cool. Yeah, All thanks. right, hey, thanks for calling in and tell your uh, tell your buddy thanks as well. Okay. Hey guys, say bye. See you later, guys. Bye. See you, later. See you buddies. <clears throat> Damn, they're having a party. Oh man. All right. What are we doing? Uh, with we our also lives? we also we skipped Pigeon. He said that he wanted to talk, and I forgot that. Uh, Pigeon, yeah. you are. Pigeon, you're live. You need. You know he's not. He needs to unmute himself. Unmute yourself. Pigeon, you're not live. Thank you. Oh, sorry. Hey, what's hey, up? What's up? <laughs> <laughs> Were you trying to talk? You're like, yeah, I can't. <laughs> All right. All so right. what what do you got? Yeah, we can hear you. What what kind of dreams you got for us? Uh. I can I share my friend's stream instead because it's a lot better than what I was going to share. I, you know, <clears throat> only if you can I, tell it really I sh- well. I shared the one about the guy having the dream, peeing all over everyone. Oh, that's so true. I think okay. it's fair that's for you true. to share someone else's. Okay. So, um, my my friend's grandma. Mm-hmm. Wait. So, no, so this is my friend's sister that has the stream. Okay. And my friend told me about it on my birthday, and their grandma died like a few months prior to my birthday. Okay. Um, her sister started having these dreams of like her waking up in like a like a hospital gown, like like screaming at her, telling her that something is coming. And then this like dark figure came out of like a chest in the corner. This is like actually her room that uh-huh. she's dreaming about. Okay. Uh-huh. And like this dark figure came out of this chest in the room and like pulled her off of her bed and pulled her into the chest and she had that dream like 20 nights in a row 20 nights in a row wait huh. yes. 20 dreams in a row or it was like 20 nights in the dream 20 nights in a row she had the same dream so it was a wow. recurring dream that's yeah you should have told that during our ghost stories podcast man sounds why did she go to they, sleep i think each they night? had just moved huh say again pigeon i, I didn't hear you he thinks they okay. just moon. Oh. That's what I heard. Okay. Moon. He also might have just died, so... Yeah. <laughs> no, oh, hey. <laughs> He's alive. I, I, I said that they had just moved. Oh, moved. oh they moved. moved. That makes more sense cool. than moved. <laughs> All right. Well, yeah, that was, a, that was a scary one. That was spoopy. <laughs> I said let's keep these positive, please. No, that was, that was interesting. Uh-huh. All right. Thanks. Too damn bad. Oh, yeah, exactly. Shit. You tell oh, him. Oh, shit. On my own <laughs> podcast. <laughs> Thanks right. for joining Talk us. Talk to you later, bitch. Yeah, bye. Okay. All right. Next up is Bethephapy. Where? There she is. Bethephapy. Bethephapy. Hello. Hello. Hi. How's Hi. How's it going? Uh, pretty good. I got home from work like an hour ago. So. Dope. Oh, nice. Me too. Welcome back Less home. Less than an hour. Yeah. I came straight from work to record the podcast. I came straight from work and then... But you're at home. Well, yeah. I, I came from work to home. I was late getting home because I, I got, now it's late cashing out. So. 
Ah. Uh, Weak. Yeah. Get good. All right. What kind of what kind of dreams you got? Cash out twenty four okay. sixty dollars. So I had one from when I was six till I was twelve. Um, it was recurring. I had it like almost every night. Mm-hmm. Whoa. <laughs> um. So you guys know that like nightmare episode of SpongeBob. Like he has he watches a scary movie at night and then like a he has a nightmare. And it's like a robot chase game. Okay. Uh, it sounds familiar. <laughs> Okay, so I had almost that identical dream, uh-huh. but it was me instead of, you know, Spongebob. Right. So I just kept running from the, the robot, and I, like, I couldn't yell. Oh. Every time I tried, it was just silence. Hmm. Interesting. And then second one was um, summer of seventh grade. I had this super obsessive crush on a dude. Okay. And he basically, like, in the lobby of a middle school, um, he was like, uh... We have to have sex to save the world. Oh. And then we got home and his, uh, no, like, I guess we were doing it. And, like, his brother walked in and then his dad walked in and started yelling at him in Portuguese. Huh. Um, and I- then they all started yelling and then I woke up. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I had that exact same dream, actually. With the same guy? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's uh, interesting. I guess, so, yeah, I guess wet dreams are on the table, everybody. It wasn't my dream, though. It was like a complete, like, what the fuck? All right, whatever. It was a sexy dream that ended in Portuguese yelling. Same thing. (laughs) (laughs) Just saying. (laughs) All right. Awesome. Well, cool. I don't, yeah, I don't really know what to make of that either. Um, we you could probably. Do I, and we, I've been trying to figure it out for almost seven years. Yeah, we could probably. Yeah, make you need a, to keep on trying to figure that out till you die. Is is preferable? Yeah, we could yeah. do a movie out of the robot one, but I'm not so sure about Portuguese. I mean, we can put them both together. Seventh grade man lover in, in the robot apocalypse. You put it in the deleted scenes area. <laughs> <laughs> cool. All right. Yeah, we'll make that one as like it'll be the bonus content. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Make, you gotta own the DV- DVD copy to see that one. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for joining us. Okay. No uh, Harvin said he wants to go last. Last? Well, that's not really up to him now, is it? Is it? Uh, I mean, we can bring him in last. <laughs> All right. Who's next? Um, yes, mate. You did not say me earlier when I asked who still wanted to go. Damn it, guys. Where are uh, we at? Sam. Sam would be next. Sam. Are you there, Sam? Sam, are you there? Yeah. Hey, oh. hey. Hold on. Hey, what's up? We can hear you now. <laughs> I don't know why, but I was muted, even though I wasn't muted on my end. Uh, this is a server mute thing. Don't worry about it. What's yeah, up? Yeah, it's just Brent sucking. So, uh, so, I don't... This isn't really a rememberable dream, except for, like, a, more of a scarring kind of dream. Uh-huh. As in, I now have a fear of, like, human-like robots. Oh. Human robots? It's Cyborgs. A, uh, androids. Like, Okay, so you know the synth, like the Gen 1 synth from Fallout 4? Maybe. I can post uh, a picture if you need to. Yes, please do. Someone drop a no picture idea, yeah. of what he's talking Gen about. Gen 1's robot. There it is. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember those things. Yeah. Oh, okay. I was mm-hmm. basically being chased in a field, and there was like a little cabin up at the top of a hill there. And these things were hunting me down. Jesus. And an army of C-3PO? You no. Know, it was great. The funny thing is, though, is that I had this nightmare before Fallout 4 existed. Oh. So it was C-3PO. So these things didn't even exist, yet this was almost exactly what I saw in my dream. I mean, that again, like, it's not like Fallout 4 invented the concept of fucking humanoid well, robots. Well, no, but like the eyes are spot on. Oh, gotcha. Maybe they stole the your dream. The eyes are what I remember the most. Hmm. Maybe Bethesda was hanging outside your window, just yeah. like stealing every, every all yeah, your they thoughts. Yeah, just stealing my dreams. Yeah, you'd think. Also, so- this is my first time being like speaking in the podcast. Oh, welcome yeah. to being speaking, my welcome friend. Welcome to being speaking. I have a voice. People. My God, I didn't know until now. I was gonna say. You I say- can talk really hard too. Oh boy. Okay. Oh, yeah, let's Thanks go ahead for joining us. <laughs> fantastic. Thanks. But, He's for joining us. I, I just wanted to say I'm surprised that considering Bethesda has such uh, advanced um, 
uh, technology yeah, lethals. Uh, dream stealing technology. You'd think they'd be able to uh, flesh out some of those bugs in their games. <laughs> no, no, no. That's part of the dream. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, dream. Right. We know how dreams go. <laughs> <laughs> that guy in the chair that just has his head spinning. That's. Yep. <laughs> you don't think that's a dream? Yep. Yeah. All right. All right. Um, Wolfman. I can't remember. Wolfman. Did you say yes earlier when I asked? I was pretty sure yes because you said wolf somewhere. I, okay, in the then wolf. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome to the podcast. We can hear you. <laughs> wolf, what's up? Hello. Hello. Can you hear me good? We can hear you good. Yes. Okay. Um, so, have you ever, like, been half sleeping and you're just laying in your bed and you feel like you trip? Every and night. And then you're just, like, jolt and you're just like, ugh. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's a it's that thing whenever like you're you're starting to go to sleep and your mm-hmm. whole body twitches. Yeah, and I also think sometimes it can be like a like a, a shot of like adrenaline too. Yeah, just like going in. It's like why Dr. are you going to sleep? There's shit you should be worrying about. This is Doctor Brett. It's just, you. Like, well, you know. Sorry, go on. <laughs> so, the only like dream I can like vividly remember is one me like not is me in my underwear at school which i'm sure a lot of people have had so yeah i don't know if i was i don't know if i was dreaming when this happened but one time uh so i was in my bed and i opened my eyes and my bed there's a little space between my bed and my wall and i, I wake up and my body's turning and it falls into the space mm. and i'm there for at least an hour but i'm yelling for my parents to come and help me up and nobody comes i'm just stuck there and my tv is stuck on like the weather channel and it's just boring as heck <laughs> the weather channel right there. <laughs> what is this purgatory yeah i never i never really had uh uh underwear at school dreams but i had underwear at church <laughs> dreams all the time dude. Yeah, the entire school had underwear and i didn't and that was the problem <laughs> but- i was fully clothed <laughs> One time I did in, like, fourth grade, though, I started walking to school and got, like, halfway down my block when I realized I was not wearing pants. Yeah? Yeah. I had one of those vivid dreams where I... That wasn't a dream that actually happened. I know, but, like, yeah, I, I had, it, on, the, on the same <laughs> other side of the coin, I had one of those vivid dreams where I dreamt I got up and got dressed and everything was ready. Uh-huh. And then when I woke up, I was shocked to hell because I could have swore I did everything that I just dreamed I did. I think I remember you telling me that before. Yeah, it, it was, might have been on an episode. It was so... It was so vivid. Yeah. It was like real life. Because I think you, you talked about that right after I mentioned the time where I woke up and got fully ready for school and showered and ate breakfast and everything and then went to wake up my mom to take me and realized it was like one in the morning. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Jesus. Yep. So, it, cool. <laughs> also, yeah. Um, I only discovered you guys like maybe two weeks ago from an ad. Wow. So, and Welcome. I like your content. So Thank good. you. Thanks. We're, we we're glad to have that. you here. Yeah, it's awesome, man. Okay, bye. <laughs> bye. <laughs> Brett's really good at uh, not knowing what to say after things. Well, I, w- I said my thing and then I left the silence for either you or him to do- It's Look, look, it's neither here nor there. We're awkward okay, dudes. Okay, truth be told, I purposely didn't mute or do anything because I wanted to see yeah, Brett's reaction. I, I noticed. Well, and then you also you held your hand at out you? and you were like, it's your turn, man, <laughs> even though I just said something. You saw me just staring at you. <laughs> oh, God. All right, who's next? Um, uh, Harvin Cossett is the one. What is, did... Yeah, yeah, you know what? He he didn't say it earlier, but we'll, we'll let him in. Yes, mate, we will call you in as yes. a favor. Yes. Yes, mate. Yes, mate. Are you here? Yes, mate. You are alive. Yeah, I'm here. Awesome. Hey, how's it going? Welcome. Okay. Wait. Um. Okay. The dream I was thinking of was when I was five, mm-hmm. I want to say. I was laying in my bed, and I was in a maze that was being run by Saw. By Jigsaw? Yeah. Okay. And your and- bed was going through this maze? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. So you were on in a bed on wheels going through a maze created by Jigsaw. Go on. Jeez. Oh, I died. Yeah, I mean, Whoa. sure. Well, that was... Did that you was wake up or did you die and then the rest he, of your dream was just I you think being he, no, dead? Ju- he just said he died. I just I kind of die in every dream. Oh. oh. Yeah. That, that makes me kind of want a dream where I die, 
but the dream doesn't end when I die. <laughs> it's just me being a fucking a corpse just sitting there for fucking the rest of the fucking dream. Well, if you don't wake up, you're going to have to, like, you come up with something like, That's I must not have died. <laughs> hmm, yeah, I guess. Your brain's always going to find some fucking excuse to keep living. Yeah. Am weak. I dead or... Exactly. Here? No, you're still here, man. You're still here with it. We're, we're real. Yeah, we can hear you. <laughs> <laughs> you you're, you're here. We're, we're glad to have you. <laughs> thanks, for, th thanks for the input, man. Yeah, and tell Jigsaw to fuck off. Next time you see him. Yes. Okay, bye. <laughs> oh, I was in the middle of muting. <laughs> yeah. oh, okay. Sorry, man. All right. Uh, okay, the only person I think that we haven't gotten is, is Harvin? Harvin Cossette. So All right. are you ready now? Now the, that we saved you for the end? You are now available to talk. Hey yo! What's hey, up? Hey yo! What's up? What How's it going? What's up? What's up, you fucking plebs? Excuse um, me? <laughs> yeah, he's talking to you. Do you know the origin of the word pleb? Did you know it's not even an insult? The plebeians were no. literally just like a, a culture of people, like in ancient times. They were just guys. <laughs> like there was nothing bad about them. I don't know why it's an insult. I thought that it was because of something. <laughs> wow! Like they, they Brent to... coming in here, sla or Brett coming in here, <laughs> slamming down some education. I'm just saying it was I like know, it's Dr. Brett in the house. I'm just saying they were Jeez. just like normal. I guess the insult is just that they were like super generic, and there yeah. wasn't anything like you know outstanding about yeah, them this is this is the this is the epitome of brett he's all like i see your joke <laughs> but you know what i'm all out of giggles so i'm gonna give you a history it's lesson it's not his joke <laughs> all right sorry go on what was your dream okay, okay so actually i'm gonna share about three interesting things with you particularly one that's kind of stuck with me over the years and has been reoccurring over and over and over by by random coincidence let Bring me it just on. say that now. Bring okay, that shit. So first, first of all, this one's just a simple dream. Um, have you guys ever played Mirror's Edge? Yeah, I've watched it. Uh, the whole the it. whole concept of just like leaping from building to building. Yeah. yeah. I remember there was this one dream where I was on top of some massive skyscrapers and I was leaping down onto each individual one, and then mm -hmm. it got to the point where I leapt out and. Uh, Missed one of them, so I just shot straight to the ground, and as soon as I hit, I woke up. Okay. Should have just flew away like Neo, just like you. <laughs> Sonic. Boom. Yeah. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't have that level of control. Yeah. Oh. Diverted course <laughs> right before you hit the ground, just zoom. But, so, this is actually kind of absurd when you think about it now, but uh, my dreams have come true. Okay. Like. Many, many, many times over. Typically, they're not, they're nothing eventful. Like, there's something simple and very trivial. Okay. But it's just, it's very weird to point this out because I've had, I, you guys may have had it before, guys in chat, everybody listening right now, but I've had dreams where, uh, when the moment comes up, all of a sudden I get this wave of deja vu. Like I've been here before. I've said this exact thing. I've done yep. this exact thing at this exact moment in time with you over here, you over here, you're talking to me. You're saying, you said that exact thing you said up here in my head. Correct. Yes. It was, uh, it's so weird. Have you, have either of you two had a dream like that before? Well, yeah, I've, I've had, I've had deja vu. They say that, they say that it's your brain processing yeah. your senses slowly. Yeah. Like it's like a, well, a fraction no, of a second well, slower. Not deja vu, you fucking numpty. I had a... I'm talking <laughs> about a, a future telling dream that came true yeah, by yeah, yeah. sheer coincidence. Yeah, I had a dream where I flunked out of high school and then I did. <laughs> <laughs> I no, no, I, I, no, I can't say that I've ever had a dream that was actually a premonition. Yeah, it's crazy. I do have one more dream, yeah, but yeah, yeah. um, based on based on what the guys uh, in chat have been saying, it's a it's a bit. Can I just say related. I keep I keep thinking that you're saying the guys and Chad. <laughs> I'm like, who's Chad? <laughs> I work with the Chad. In chat, the guys in chat. Yeah, sorry, I just I keep mishearing it. Vor related, <laughs> vor related dream. Oh, good. Primarily because. Uh, go ahead. Feel free to kink shame me, but I am into Vor, so you're I'll disgusting. Say that now, and I'll leave it at that. You're a plebeian. <laughs> I am a fucking. You can't turn it back you. around, bro. Yeah, shit. It loses <laughs> yeah. all its meaning. Okay. I mean, okay, I mean so, that was the point, right? So, I wanted it to not have no, meaning. I guess so. It, mm. so. There's this character that goes by the name Sophie. She's a big green dragon character, and um, what ended up happening was I ended up 
getting stuck in her house uh-huh. and i don't know why don't don't ask me why but for some reason i was stuck in her house and uh when i was trying to run from her for some reason there was the the bathroom with stalls you know like for some like i don't know why they were sectioned off like this but they were like three by four sort of like three like four against the walls and then four in the middle two two sets of four against the walls and one set of four in the middle of the room and i ended up hiding in one of those oh. um uh her lackey i don't know i don't exactly remember it came searching for me as well as her but I managed to hide out in one of the stalls, and then when I tried to get out, her lackey took notice of me, and I, I bolted out the door. And I don't know how the dream ended off like this, but I but I went and hid out in the grass when it was pitch black out, mm-hmm. and uh, it just sort of ended off there. Interesting. Interesting uh, indeed. For anybody who knows what Vor is, they'd un- they'd remember the name Sophie because it's a very popular character Who, sophie's anyway, a big green thing s-o-p-i-e sophie yeah look it up, big Brad. green dragon okay I'm, I'm gonna i'm gonna look um, he's gonna look it up right now yeah. <laughs> well, all right well then, are, you, are you are you going to <laughs> yeah yeah i'm gonna look it up while while okay, we fine. while we bring in our last caller so thanks for yeah. the call uh thanks uh, man wait, wait 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 before you oh, go yeah. you're telling uh, us to wait i i know i know hold on <laughs> go ahead. brent yes are you still are you are you still open to that whole idea that I gave up that I gave out to you a little while ago? Yes, we're still open to that. That's a hint for you guys out there. It's the one I told you about. Oh, that's right. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Cool. Yes. Please. Yeah. Yes. Thanks for bringing it up with no context. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, big I things wanna, are I want to keep it subtle for now. <laughs> yep. Hope you guys hope you guys have a great night. Thanks for letting you me too. pop in. All right, peace Thanks out, for man. joining us. All right, so yeah. uh, we who came in? It was uh, Fletch came in last minute, so we're actually gonna um, bring in Fletch real quick. Also, Fletch, to talk. are you there? Can you can you unmute yourself? <laughs> hey, hey what's up, Fletch? Hey, can hello. I can I be heard? You can be heard. You got a bit of an I echo, will, but will, will it, if anything, it just sounds really epic. So, like yes. when you're explaining your dream, <laughs> just be very announcy about. Just say it. these are the Ten Commandments. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm sorry, I'm usually using the mic, but I like, oh, wait, I have a pod. There's a podcast, no. and I just pulled it up on my phone real quick. You're fine, dude. Just go ahead. What uh, what, uh, what, what kind of dream you got? Okay, this is the dream that I, ever, that I have had since my childhood. Mm-hmm. I haven't ha- I've had it in my childhood. It, it was a reoccurring dream in my childhood. I don't have it anymore. Mm-hmm. But it's the stupidest stuff. But when I was a kid, it was the scariest thing. Like my shirt dream. It was very simple. <laughs> yeah. Basically... I was being, I was being taken. Okay, so I was running. I was running from. <laughs> How do you spell that? Yeah. I was running, yeah. Uh, no, no. <laughs> I was running across a barren wasteland. It was very fiery. It was like death all around, etc. Uh huh. But I was being chased by midgets with jetpacks in army fatigues that wanted to handcuff me around the neck. I mean, you still taking notes for that movie? Hell out of yeah, me dude. As a kid. <laughs> I mean that's a, that's a founded fear I think. <laughs> you wouldn't want that in real life. I mean the midget part isn't important, but I mean they got they got yeah. they got jetpacks and they're trying to what were they trying to do? Steal your testicles or some okay. shit? No, 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 no. I can't they remember what he said. Handcuffs, that's that. right. <laughs> what is <laughs> so, put it around his neck? Hand oh, around his neck. Around I heard yeah, I heard I heard around your nuts. <laughs> you heard stealing his sorry. testicles. You I heard <laughs> around his nuts. <laughs> I'm sorry. What did your movie just turn into a porno? <laughs> Apparently. Yeah, no, I, I, I think that's a founded fear. I don't think you need to be ashamed of that dream, and I don't think you should consider it to be silly. I think you need to analyze why that scares you and, and uh, learn from it. Yeah. The problem is I had that dream many times. Oh, and did, I have problem. No idea did any of them involve your nuts at some point? Thankfully, no. Oh, okay. I was like... Seven. Oh, thankfully no. Okay. I don't know, man. I had dreams about my nuts when no, I was seven. We're not, okay. <laughs> <laughs> we're not going there, Brett. <laughs> All right. Well, thanks for the call, Fletch. Thanks for the call, man. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Love you. Yeah, no, bro. Love you too, man. Love you too. And awesome. We got we got one last little movie pitch there at the end. Oh yeah. yeah. I think Blue said like just put the whole thing into yeah. one movie, just everybody's. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, <laughs> just make one clusterfuck. <laughs> hey, maybe we can make it into an animation. <clears throat> hint, hint. <laughs> She's like, where's Dan? Yeah, where you at, Dan? <laughs> He's like, what are you signing me up for? 
There's Dan the Man. Yeah. Uh, okay, then I guess <laughs> the most ambitious crossover, <laughs> basically, in cinema history. Um, that was a good. I, that was fun. Get that. Sh- oh, that's the. That's, that's the, the dragon. Okay. All right. Fine. Yeah. I was about to yell at somebody. <laughs> the context of it. Yeah, I actually I did find her when I when I did a, a Google search. She exists. <laughs> she's she's a dragon woman. Uh, we're gonna end our podcast the way that we end every podcast, which is we're gonna have one person. Oh, Cameron, sorry, you gotta go, man. Uh, we'll we'll just message you about what the change is. We'll yeah, probably do an announcement stuff. in the announcement channel. Yep, yep. Um, uh, we're gonna end the podcast the way we end every podcast, which is we're gonna let one of you guys. Ask us a question, just like a Q&A episode, except it's here and it's on the spot and we don't have time to think of our answers, even though we don't think of our answers before the Q&As <laughs> yeah. either. We probably should, so that they're not such fucking garbage nah, nah, fires. Nah, I think that's great. <laughs> okay, so if anyone would like to ask us a question, um, type the word... Well, what? maybe maybe we make them guess a number and then like the closest to the number. Oh, there we go. Okay, okay, everybody... Oh, hold on, let me get a number in my head real quick. I have a number. Everybody type one number. Wolfman, you're already disqualified. <laughs> Only one number. Yes. Well, you didn't even tell them the range. <laughs> <It's just> like, <laughs> no, that's why. It's perfect. Um, okay, we're giving it five more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. And <laughs> the closest... What was the number? The number was 12, so I think... Yeah, Wolf I think Wolfman was at eleven. Sixty-nine. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Wolfman wins. Even though, but I told Wolfman he was disqualified. Oh. No, it's fine. We'll take a question from Wolfman. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you disqualify him? I was a Because he just put a bunch of numbers. Oh, I mean that's fine. That was a guess. No, no, no. Up top. Up top. He oh, did, you mean a whole like, bunch? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, we weren't looking at those numbers. Yeah. All right. All right cool, uh, Wolfman. Where, where we are. We are go. bringing you in. All right. So, uh, hello. So, we Wolfie? can hear you. You have a question, uh, just ask us any question. And and by the way, when he asked the question, everybody answered the question for you as well Personally. in the chat. Yeah. Answer for yourselves whatever question he has yes. in the chat. Stop guessing numbers! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, go on. I'm just going to guess this because I've never seen this. Okay. Will you post this on YouTube? Uh, the, the podcast itself? Yes, it will yeah. be. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, we, we, we record the podcast at the beginning of the month. And then they go up at the end of the month. And if anybody doesn't want to be in it, who talk to us has to yeah. uh, send us a message, and then they get edited out. Mm-hmm. And the the reason that there wasn't a podcast uh, at the end of last month, at the end of May, was because we didn't do one at the beginning of May because uh, Brent and Monica were on their cruise, and, and we, there was just cruising. a lot of shit. They were cruising for a bruising. Uh, was that your question? Uh, I guess so. Throw another one at us. Yeah, one throw, more. An- throw another one because nobody else can answer that one. Yeah. <laughs> Um, or we can get we can get another person if you if you don't have one at the ready. Yeah. Okay. Get another person. Okay. Cool. All right, All right guys. Guess another <laughs> number. You have five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. And it looks like yes, was mate, it? was the closest because my number was eighty. Eighty. Oh no 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 no. Pumpkin was closer. Pumpkin is the closest. Seventy six. Yep. Yeah. All right. Cool. All right, let's see, pumpkin. Pumpkin. All right. Sorry, yes, mate. I didn't mean uh, to lead you on like that. <laughs> same rules. He's uh, gonna ask a question. And everybody has to answer. Yes, it does. Okay, cool. Um, so what would you say is your favorite kind of candy? Favorite candy for me, it's payday. Oh man, that's not is candy. That's not candy. Payday is it's a candy it's, bar. It's is it a candy bar? Or is it a cookie bar or a chocolate bar? There's three different. Uh, payday. It's it's like it's um nuts and caramel, right? Yeah, it's like caramel. What's your, fine, fine. What's your favorite sweet? Oh, okay. Okay, <laughs> favorite sweet. Um, I'm gonna go with. Ah, oh, jeez. Laffy taffy. My God. No, saltwater taffy. Oh, saltwater taffy. Uh, even though is that even sweet? Because that's like salty. <laughs> but it doesn't not... matter. It's a candy. Okay, saltwater taffy. It is. It's some sort. It's it's a, yeah. it's a Ta- dessert. Taffy's disgusting. You're disgusting. Okay, I I have a big problem with this one, and that's because uh, in my family we really like sweets. Okay. Um. So there's so many, so many things that uh, that I really like. I can't really pick one. I like uh, maybe let's go with right now. First thing on my brain, red velvet cake. Red velvet cake. Red velvet cake. It's pretty lame. 
Out of all the things you could have chosen, you it was, chose it was like. It's on my brain right Red now. Red Velvet is so fucking bland, dude. It was on my mind right now. You said saltwater taffy. <laughs> That's true, I did. <laughs> when I was younger, I had a bad allergic reaction to some red velvet cake. Really? Yeah. See? And you support yeah. that kind of thing, Brent. Yeah, I, su- I support all allergic reactions, You support I guess. allergic reactions. <laughs> Just as a whole. I had this rash on my face for like a week or so. Oof. Oof. Yeah, that's how I am with pineapple. It's like weird and painful and bleh. Yeah, it's like a rash. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I get that with pineapple. But I still eat a shit ton of pineapple because it's delicious. I like Rocky Road, too. Oh, Rocky like Road is a shit. Put those two together. I don't think Rocky Not Road really counts together, as a sweet, though. Like, yeah, it does. Does it? It's a dessert. It's like chocolate. Has chocolate. Not a sweet? I mean, it's got nuts. <laughs> that disqualifies it. <laughs> nuts I mean, you disqualified, disqualified my payday because it had nuts. No, he said candy. Payday is a candy. It's not a candy bar. It's a, it's it a Snickers. A it's a Snickers okay. a candy. Change it to sweets. He changed it to sweets, so there you go. Is Snickers a sweet? Yes. Then why yes. is that a... The, wait, <laughs> what? You're on a different topic. What, what makes a Snickers Dude, a sweet need, but not a payday? Right, Just right. because it has chocolate Hold in on. it? Brett's going to go home and rest. He's feeling a little sick. Yes, payday is candy. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> Thank you all for joining us. <laughs> yeah, thanks, guys. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, you said candy bar. Shut the f- okay, whatever. All right, podcast I is over. I said candy bar, but I changed it to sweet, okay? <laughs> okay, fine. No, we're going on about no. this. Pagan! Man, if only Brett was on a mic, I could <laughs> mute him. Chat, okay? <laughs> All right, thanks, thanks for, for the call, Thanks for the question. All right, podcast is over. I don't know when it <laughs> ended, but it ended. Yeah, at some point when uh, you were yelling. So now, <laughs> we have a big announcement. Super big announcement. And it doesn't look like... Even half of the people stayed, even though we told people to stay for the announcement. That's okay. Would you like to give the announcement? Me? Yeah. Hold on. Wait. Hold on. Let's bring. Let's bring someone. Oh, in. we're gonna bring somebody in for the announcement. All right. Let's let's oh bring a couple. Oh my god. Let's bring here. in maybe two people for the announcement. All right. We have. We have. We have. Uh, yeah. Somebody needs Bethany, to. Bethany, uh, you need unmute to themselves. Mute. Yeah. Uh, Muth. 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 You're not muted anymore, Hi. by the way. So hey, don't, okay. Don't be talking smack about Brett. Like Moof, you you're there as well. So we would like to introduce you guys. Um, you guys all know Moof and Beth. Uh, we're still going to be doing the Gamer Bus podcast once a month. At the That's beginning not of the changing. Month. We're, we're going to continue our podcast yes. that goes up on the channel. Like However, that. because it seems like everybody really enjoys the podcast, uh, we're going to have Moof and Bethany run a uh, weekly podcast. Or maybe bi-weekly. bi-weekly. They'll, they'll work it out on yeah. their schedules. But it depends it, on my work schedule. And yeah. Things. So so Beth and Moof will work it out she with all of you guys. Like, never. <laughs> Sorry, go on. Oh, she was saying we'll work it out on both of our work schedules. And I was like, mine is never. Oh, that's fine. Cool. So just... Mine's uh, so fucking random right now. Yeah. That's all right. But as long as, as, long as uh, everybody knows, you two will be running... So it's uh, going to be a community podcast. Yeah, it's going to be exactly the same uh, way we do it here. One of the things that we're, we're trying to do uh, with our mods is get them more involved in stuff. Mm-hmm. Um, so we thought this was a, a, a great way. It was, uh, I think you guys brought it up. Yeah. Uh, you guys being Moof and Beth uh, mm-hmm. brought it up, and we thought it was a, it was a great idea. We yep. want to get our moderators to, to, to help develop the community uh, because Brett and I, uh, we have – a lot of stuff going on. Yeah. And not just work, but we're also doing a lot of like recording stuff for the channel. And we're mm-hmm. doing a lot of testing and so Working it's sucking some, up a bunch of time. Yeah, new projects and stuff. So uh, the moderator is going to step up a little bit on the uh, on, on working with the community. And, and I, I think this would be awesome because then you develop. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. You guys can keep building. Uh, and yeah, like Sam mentioned, so he's going to be running the movie nights now. Uh, don't be surprised if you see... Um, <laughs> don't be surprised if you see uh, one of the mods running a uh, a weekly battle or something along those lines. Yeah, uh, Pablo may pick up the the gamer brush again. So yeah, just keep an eye out. Uh, none of you guys be surprised. The mods are going to be uh, having a much. Uh, it doesn't mean we're disappearing. Yeah, by the way, just the mods will be having a larger hand in in how we operate things around At here. At least not yet. 